Have you ever wondered how those paper bills we use every day are actually made? From euros to dollars, billions of them are exchanged around the world daily, keeping our global economy thriving. We've all dreamed of being millionaires or felt that unexpected thrill of finding a lost bill on the ground. But have you ever stopped to think about the intricate process behind creating these pieces of paper that hold so much value? Let's take a journey into a banknote factory and uncover the secrets behind one of the world's most desired objects. We'll show you how each design is born, how that special paper is made, and how millions of bills are printed with incredible precision. Step 1. Designing the Banknote Designing a banknote is a fascinating blend of art, technology, and security. It begins with a blank canvas and a team of designers, artists, and security experts. Their mission? To create something that's not only visually appealing, but also nearly impossible to counterfeit. The first step is color selection. Each hue is chosen carefully, not just for its aesthetic appeal, but also for its resistance to replication. Next, the images and symbols adorning the note are meticulously selected to represent the country's culture, history, and values. Intricate patterns are then added, creating a visual puzzle for counterfeiters. These patterns often interact with light, changing color or appearing and disappearing as the note is tilted. Security threads, those thin lines embedded in the paper, add another layer of protection while giving the note a sophisticated look. The entire process is conducted with utmost care and confidentiality. The final design is more than just a piece of paper. It's a masterpiece of engineering, design, and security. Step 2. Crafting Special Paper The next step in creating a banknote involves producing a unique type of paper. Unlike regular paper made from wood pulp, this material is made from pure cotton fibers, giving it a durable texture, a distinctive crispness, and a longer lifespan. The process begins by mixing cotton fibers with water and other components to create a homogeneous pulp. This mixture is then passed through massive rollers that flatten it into thin sheets. This is where many of the security features we mentioned earlier are incorporated, such as watermarks and security threads. Watermarks are created by varying the thickness of the paper, allowing certain designs to be visible only when held up to the light. It's fascinating how such a delicate detail is embedded directly into the material during manufacturing. Security threads are also integrated into the paper while it's still wet, becoming an inseparable part of its structure. They'll play a crucial role in ensuring the authenticity of the note. Additionally, colored microfibers are randomly dispersed, creating tiny details that are nearly impossible to counterfeit. Once the sheets are ready, they undergo rigorous quality control. The thickness, texture, and presence of security features are meticulously checked to ensure each sheet is perfect before moving on to the next stage. Step 3. Engraving and Preparing Printing Plates Now we enter one of the most fascinating stages in banknote production, creating the printing plates. Have you heard of intaglio? It's the method of engraving a design into metal, allowing it to be transferred to paper. First, the banknote design is engraved onto steel or copper plates. This process combines high technology with skilled craftsmanship. Laser machines carve out the general outlines of the design, and then artisans refine the delicate details by hand to ensure every line and texture is perfect. These plates are then prepared for printing. Special ink is applied to the engraved areas, and the flat surfaces are cleaned. When paper is pressed against these plates under high pressure, the design is transferred creating a raised image that you can feel. Each color on the note requires its own plate, so this process is repeated multiple times until the final design is complete. This method not only makes the note look spectacular, but also provides an additional layer of security, making it extremely difficult to counterfeit. Step 4. Printing the Banknotes Now that we have our special paper and meticulously engraved plates, we arrive at the exciting process of printing. Ever wondered how thousands of banknotes are printed with such precision? This is where it all comes to life, a dream come true for any money lover. We start with offset printing. Now you might be wondering, what exactly is that? Well, this technique involves applying ink to the banknotes through rollers, transferring the designs of each type of note to both sides. Setting up the machines for this process can take over a day due to the required precision. 
Next, we introduce screen printing, used to add the so-called emerald number, which indicates the value of the note. This security feature, which changes color from green to blue depending on the angle, is common in modern banknotes like euros or dollars, although not present in all banknotes worldwide. Then comes intaglio printing, one of the most fascinating steps in the process. Here, the paper is pressed forcefully against the engraved plates, transferring the design with such precision that an embossed texture is created. If you've touched a banknote and felt those raised areas, you know what I'm talking about. This texture not only feels nice, but also makes it extremely difficult to counterfeit. Finally, we move on to the numbering press, where each banknote receives its unique serial number. Think of it as the banknote's fingerprint. This number, composed of up to 15 digits and letters, allows it to be identified and traced back to its origin if necessary. With each of these steps, the banknotes come to life and get closer to their final form. But we're not finished yet. Before they can reach our hands, they must undergo a final test, ensuring that each banknote is perfect. Step 5. Inspection and Quality Control Now we arrive at a crucial step in banknote production, inspection and quality control. Can you imagine how many checks each banknote goes through before entering the world? Over 20 different checks. This shows how serious and meticulous this process is. In this critical phase, a combination of advanced technology and the human eye work together to detect any possible errors. Machines equipped with state-of-the-art sensors scan each banknote looking for the slightest imperfections, from differences in line thickness to flaws in the security features. At the same time, specialized operators visually inspect each sheet, armed with special magnifying glasses to ensure there are no printing errors or ink stains. And what happens to defective banknotes? They are destroyed on the spot and recycled safely to avoid any possibility of misuse. This guarantees that only perfect banknotes reach your hands. But there's more. This quality control process not only detects errors, but also ensures the uniformity of banknotes produced in different locations. So, no matter where it was printed, each banknote must match exactly in size, color, and texture with its counterparts. Incredible, right? With all these controls passed, the banknotes are finally ready to enter circulation. Ready to see how these banknotes are distributed and end up in your wallet? Step 6. Cutting and Packaging now that the banknotes have passed all quality tests, it's time to prepare them for distribution. Can you imagine how much precision is required to cut thousands of banknotes in just one hour? It's amazing accuracy. The process begins with large sheets full of banknotes that are placed in high-precision cutting machines. These powerful machines divide each sheet into bundles of individual banknotes, ensuring that they all have exactly the same size and shape. Think of it as a surgical cut that guarantees perfection in each note. Next, these banknotes are organized into bundles of 100 and wrapped in self-sealing plastic. This wrapping protects them from moisture and dust, keeping them in optimal condition during transportation. Additionally, this packaging method helps keep the banknotes neat and secure. Finally, the bundles of banknotes are carefully stacked in cardboard boxes, each designed to hold up to 10,000 notes. Just imagine having one of these boxes. You'd be practically a millionaire. These are labeled with detailed information, including the denomination and serial number range, facilitating control and traceability during distribution. Step 7. Storage and Distribution Finally, after a rigorous inspection and packaging process, the banknotes are ready to be stored before distribution. Can you imagine where these banknotes are stored before reaching you? In high-security vaults equipped with advanced monitoring systems capable of withstanding fires, floods, and even theft attempts. These vaults are not only fortresses, but also maintain perfect conditions to preserve the quality of the paper and ensure the integrity of each banknote. When it's time to distribute them, armored vehicles and sometimes air transportation are used, depending on the need and logistics of each region. Did you know that a single armored truck can carry banknotes worth the value of a small country? It's impressive to think how something so compact can contain so much value. These banknotes eventually reach banks, from where they are distributed, and enter circulation to reach our hands. Every banknote we use to pay in our daily lives has gone through an incredibly detailed and secure journey. So there you have it. From a simple design to becoming part of our economy, each banknote is a small marvel of engineering and design, a masterpiece that supports every transaction we make.
Discovering this entire process makes one appreciate even more that piece of paper we carry in our wallets. Were you surprised to discover everything involved in the production of money? Share your opinion in the comments. And if you enjoyed this tour of banknote manufacturing, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel to explore more fascinating manufacturing processes.